the typical like pre-race just excitement and just making sure the you know not forget anything on the way up to the starting line. Marathon Monday and Megan Roth was in her routine. She'd run Boston before she knew the course and was feeling great. Even going into the race, um, fell, you know, really just in the best shape of my life. Megan crossed that starting line and started cruising. Around mile eight, something went horribly wrong. It was literally seconds where all of a sudden I remember I just kind of went fuzzy and I remember looking down at my feet and then all of a sudden it just went. I don't even remember hitting the ground. Megan had gone into cardiac arrest in the middle of the marathon course. Several people sprang into action, performing CPR until an ambulance could arrive, including fellow runner Nick Haney, who first met Megan in 2019 and had just seen her the night before the race. When I saw her, uh, there was already a woman had initiated compressions and a, a young man that was um, holding her airway open. And I had I directed him to continue holding her airway open. Uh, I felt for a pulse. Megan was rushed to the hospital, then taken to Tufts Medical Center for treatment. Now back home in Minnesota with her 10 month old baby boy, Megan and her mom can't say enough about the help they got in Boston. I just so thankful because like, I was like, I think of it's my grandson, you know, and not having his mother and just so many things. I'm so blessed to be home with my with my son and to be to be doing so well. Like they just I'm I'm so lucky they were there. They saved my life and I, I just I don't think I can ever thank them enough. You know, and as we mentioned, Megan is back home in Minnesota after having an implantable cardioverter defibrillator implanted. The device would shock her heart back into a normal rhythm if something like this happens again. She and her mom are still hoping to find the woman who first started chest compressions when Megan collapsed that day. They just want to say thank you.